If you are looking to upgrade to a very spacious 3 bedroom plus family entertainment room and a study room in the heart of Sengkang area, which is exactly 5 minutes walking distance to the MRT station, then I have an ideal duplex unit just for you. Hello everyone, I'm Sean from Urban Agents and today we are here at The Vales which is one of the newest executive condo in the heart of Sengkang area which just TOP in year 2017. This development is just 2 minutes uh, walk to the nearest RRT stations which gets you back to the Sengkang MRT station and what I like about this development is that it contains family-friendly full condo facilities just for you and me. And today, we are going to showcase a Maisonette unit which is uh, over 1,646 square feet and there are only 15 such units in this development. It's such a rare opportunity to take a look at it and I'm glad to show you this right now. Right now, we are inside this Maisonette unit which spreads across 1,646 square feet in floor area across two floors and it contains three bedrooms, four bathrooms, a family entertainment room and a study area as well as a designated car park lot just for you. If you need to apply for the second car park lot, you can do so from the management office free of charge just for this particular unit. Just to let you know that there are only 15 such units in this entire development and it is so rare to have this unit to be put up on sale because the owners have gotten a special approval for early sale. As you step into this maisonette, you are greeted by a luxurious space uh, which houses a 5-seater dining table set over here as well as your piano area and good thing is that the living hall, you can easily put in a 4-seater or even a 5-seater long couch plus a big TV console area with your display shelves. Putting in a 55-inch flat TV is not an issue at all. This living space extends out to the outdoor patio area where you can have a little alfresco area and you enjoy the view of the surrounding greenery. You enjoy this privacy because it's not facing directly head-on to the swimming pool area. So let's check out the rest of the premises. I will show you around. Stepping into this fully equipped kitchen space, you'll notice that there are built-in cooker hob and a hood on my right with, together with your kitchen sink. And over on my left, you have additional pantry storage as well as a built-in convection oven for your baking needs. And you can easily put in a big capacity fridge right at the designated area. And good thing about this kitchen space, it is well ventilated by an open service yard just right behind me. And here you can do your laundry space, you can easily put in a front-loading washing machine as well as a dryer that's stacked on top. And you have uh, additional storage space in the utility room as well as the fourth toilet that is over here. Stepping into the bedroom walkway from the living hall area, you will notice that all the three bedrooms are located on the same level. And this staircase, it leads down to your basement which contains the family entertainment room and the study area as well as the direct access to the individual car park lot. Coming to the first common bedroom, you will notice that it enjoys a very good ceiling height and it comes in with the built-in sliding door wardrobe and you can put in a super single bed or even a queen size bed. The view actually opens up to the courtyard area and the surrounding greenery. Let's check out the other bedroom. Right now, we are at the second bedroom which is used as a children's bedroom. You can see how spacious it is because of its width and its height. You can easily put in a double deck bed where you have your queen size mattress at the bottom and a single mattress at the top. And what I like is that the view opens up to the sunken courtyard area and it actually acts as a form of a setback away from the communal spaces right outside and this ensures your privacy of your loved ones in the house. Good thing as well that it contains a sliding door wardrobe which acts as an additional storage space for your children. Before we check out the master bedroom, now we're going to show you the common bathroom that is along the bedroom walkway. And what I like is that you have a very decent sized uh, standing shower area and you have a mirror cabinet which you can put in the toiletries right behind it. And the good thing is that the encasement windows helps to ventilate the whole entire premises. Well, let's go in and check out the master room. 
Stepping into this spacious master bedroom, you can see that the owner has done up the renovations uh, in terms of the step-up platform as well as the headboard. This step-up platform, they are able to have these drawers which contains additional clothing items. And over here at the front part of the platform, they have additional storage space for other of their personal belongings. Over here, you have your flat wall hung TV and you enjoy your entertainment channels at a comfort on your own bed. These full height windows, it allows for natural ventilation and natural lighting into the premises and you enjoy the greenery view of the sunken courtyard area. Over here, you have your two door sliding wardrobes and behind me is the attached bathroom where you have a proper standing shower area which is ventilated by a big encasement window. Well, let's check out the rest of the premises in the basement. Come with me. Stepping down into the basement area, you will notice that the owner has done an overhaul renovation and they actually managed to craft out a study area which is known as the workstation area which is enclosed as well as the family lounge area where they enjoy their entertainment. They have put in the additional storage space on the outside as well as those cabinets on the inside in the workstation area. You can easily put in two computer desktop and you can also enjoy you know, watching TV from the inside. The good thing about this family lounge area, it is fronted by the sunken courtyard which allows for natural ventilation and lighting filtered into this area. This is your direct access to your designated car park lot and you also have access to the common area that's right on the second level. And this family lounge comes in with a dry powder area as well as a bathroom and a shower area. Alright, here we are at the Vale's main drop-off point and what I like about this entire front foyer space is that it is sheltered and you have direct access via through the lift or through the staircase to the clubhouse that's on the second level and that houses the main swimming pool facilities, the clubhouse, uh, the function room and the games room. This road level is separated away from the communal space and it gives the residents some form of a privacy and a buffer away from the traffic noises. Here we are at Anchorvale Crescent and this estate houses a handful of executive condos in Sengkang area. First and foremost, we have the Vales which TOP in year 2017 and this plot of land is the closest proximity to Sengkang MRT station. And of course, we have the Bell Waters which also TOP in year 2017 and is just round the bend of this road. And behind me, you see that the completed project which is known as the Treasure Crest the TOP in year 2018 and this ongoing construction it is known as the All Our Residences EC which is going to TOP in year 2023. Well, I would like to say that the first three ECs namely the Vales, Bellwaters and the Treasure Crest the launch price at the time was around $750 to $800 per square foot whereas we know that All Our Residences is already going for $1,100 to $1,200 PSF. Well, we are going to go in-depth analysis of the Vales in comparison with these three surrounding ECs as well as other privatised condos located near to Sengkang MRT station. Well, let's do a comparison between the Vales Executive Condo to the Ola Residences EC. Ola Residences will only TOP in year 2023 whereas the Vales is already constructed and it has been only 3 years since its TOP and good thing to know that the unit is in its brand new condition. The entry point for all our residents is on the high side. It is at $1,100 to $1,200 per square foot. Whereas comparing to the Vales, this particular unit is selling below $900 per square foot. Now let's do a price comparison between the Vales EC to the similar 3 beta units uh, in the privatized condos next to the MRT station which is uh, the resale units sold in the year 2018 to 2020. The luxury, which TOP in year 2011, it is sold for $1,150 per square foot recently. For La Fiesta, which TOP in year 2012, it is sold recently for $1,250 per square foot. 
and these are the similar 3 bedroom units which is between 1000 to 1800 square feet in floor area. Why we favour executive condos over privatised condominiums is because that executive condos have greater capital gain potential due to the lower entry point. This particular unit in the Vales, the owner has a special grant for early sale and therefore it means that you are entering at a first mover's advantage and you still enjoy the upside when it reaches its MOP stage. Another advantage living in District 19 area is because we are located next to the upcoming Pongo Digital District which is our future development in the master plan. And you know that the development of the Silita Aerospace Park, it means that there will be continual transformation to enhance the area, to beautify the area and create more homes and offices and including recreation community spaces for the residents in District 19. The Vales EC is conveniently located next to Chengling LRT station which is one stop away from Sengkang MRT station and that is the place where it houses the Compass One shopping mall and it has the cold storage supermarket as well as uh, various amenities such as the Sengkang Community Club and the Polyclinic. Good thing is that it is also within 5 minutes walking distance to Kopitiam Square where it houses a wet market for the Sengkang residents. There are plenty of primary schools uh, for your child's education such as the Springdale Primary School, Anchor Green Primary School, Nanqiao Primary, North Vista Primary, Sengkang Primary, Riverville Primary School as well as North Spring Primary School. If you are driving, we are easily 2 minutes uh, driving distance along Sengkang East Road to the TPE Expressway and if you are going to KPE, you can head southwards and turn to your left towards Buangkok Drive and into the KPE Tunnel. If you are looking for a move-in ready condition of a 3 bedroom plus entertainment room and a study room duplex unit, in the heart of Sengkang area, located close to the surrounding amenities as well as the Sengkang MRT station, then please feel free to call me at my mobile number. I'm Sean from Urban Agents. If you like videos like this, please do not forget to subscribe to our channel and I look forward to see you in my next exclusive listing. See you then!